<clears throat> okay, uh, injury report. Uh, Blitzen is uh, nursing a sprained uh, back left hoof. He's uh, going to be uh, on the shelf for the next uh, three weeks. Uh, three elves had uh, splinters removed from their hands. Uh, they'll be uh, limited. They'll be out for the rest of the week. The trainers will be working with them uh, carefully. Mrs. Claus uh, sustained, it, sustained a uh, <clears throat> first degree burn on her forearm from uh, baking cookies. So uh, she'll be limited today in uh, practice and uh, working with the trainers as well. Um, <clears throat> as, uh, as always, we, uh, we look forward to the challenge of uh, delivering Christmas presents to little boys and girls all over the world. Uh, as you know, it's a, it's a great time of year. Uh, very challenging for us up here in the North Pole. Um, time's yours. Hey, Santa, Sal Palantonio here from ESPN. Uh, so Christmas is coming up. How excited are you for this Christmas compared to Christmases in the past? Well, uh, well, you know, you, you always look forward to uh, every Christmas, but uh, gosh, uh, <clears throat> this this year uh, there's just a little more uh, sugar in that candy. John Clark, NBC 10, John Clark, John Clark, yeah. Uh, last year you missed some houses. What are you going to do this year so you won't miss those houses? Well, that, 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 that one falls on me, uh, you know, that Santa Claus. <clears throat> you know, I, I got to put the, uh, my elves and uh, reindeer in a better position to, uh, you know, get, get to all the houses in the world so uh, children will be able to uh, enjoy uh, Christmas the next morning. Santa, Howard Eskin, Fox. You know, some uh, girls and boys on the naughty list last year received presents. What's up with that? <coughs> well, I, um, I, looked at, I looked at my list, you know, and uh, during, during the second round, I thought uh, there were some kids who, uh, you know, had some potential and uh, just, uh, just didn't pan out. That's, that's not a knock against them. It's just uh, things didn't pan out. They're, they're going to have a great career uh, as good boys and girls. Yeah, I can guarantee it, but here it just didn't pan out. <laughs> hey, Santa, Derek, D Gun, Gun. Uh, so the plan is going green this year, and there's a shortage on coal. What would the naughty children be receiving this year? Well, uh, I've uh, I sat down with Mrs. Claus and uh, some of my coordinators, and we decided in the best interest of the children that uh, they would be receiving uh, Philadelphia Eagles uh, hats and T-shirts with the word uh, Dynasty on it. <laughs> Hi, Santa. Sit down, Bowen. Hi, Jeff McLean, Philadelphia Inquirer. Uh, I got, I was supposed to get a rocking horse in 1964. Got a G.I. Joe instead. What happened to it? <coughs> well, uh, <coughs> well, you know, <coughs> sometimes you just call for the, um, <coughs> the, the wrong toy when you, when you get to a house. Hi, uh, Mike Missanelli, uh, the fanatic. Uh, Santa, have you ever uh, thought of stepping down because of some of the mistakes that have happened? Um, I'm standing in front of my team, all right, man. I'm, I'm telling them, them, you know, these are the things we need to do. One of which is that uh, we need to uh, continue to battle. That would be a cop out if I, uh, <clears throat> if I step down. That's. That's just not the way I'm wired, you see, man. That's that's not the way they think these things are. We we just gotta keep going to battle. Okay, thank you.